Hello everyone, so today we are going to be opening the January 2021's Ipsy Glam Bag Plus and let's see just get this cutter here Refreshments Pleasant Wipes. I think this was a free trial product. So, yeah. So, these refreshments cleansing face wipes. As well as this Refreshments Luscious Hand Cream and Citrus Spritz. sealed right here. Just open it. Over here. Looks like this. It's just a white cream. And my hands are kind of dry, so perfect timing. Okay. It smells really good. It smells like Honestly, it smells like a Starbucks drink. <laughs> so, that's nice. Let's see. Luscious Hand Cream by the Ipsy Refreshments. Also says it's made in Canada. Okay. So there's that. So show us how you get funky. And there's a bunch of stickers. Vanishing Born Routines and yeah, I think this was um I think this was free. Um like a like a trial and after that um you can sign up for essentials. So there's like a razor that's coming soon. And it's five dollars. It's two cartridges, face wipes, hand cream, shaving cream, body cream, body wash. Yeah, and I think it's all under ten bucks. And you can adjust the frequency. So there's that. Okay, and then this is the the bag for yeah, it's the bag for the month. And little ad for next month. Um, black bag plus, and this other flyer. Okay, so there's nothing there. So the first item here is the. I'll just move this box here so it's easier. The Vitagrid Vitamin C Foaming Cleanser. And this is made in Korea. So. my cutter right here. Okay, so it looks like this. Foam cleanser says it contains a protiotary 
blend of fighter bread CG to remove impurities in that skin. It has like an herbal smell to it. It's not very strong, but it's definitely there. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it foams up really well. So, okay. So that's the first item. Second item here is by Glow Recipe. And this is Smoothing and Nourishing Balm. I think this is lip balm. it is a lip balm. As you can see here, looks like this. It does smell like watermelon. And it has like little scrubbies in it, I believe. So that's really nice. I personally really love getting lip balms and these subscriptions. So, Next item is the Jasmine Oil Blend. And I got the Rose Blend from the Gunner Lore box before. But I love Jasmine, so let's see. Hmm. clear oil. Mm. It has a very faint jasmine smell, but it's really nice. I feel like it would be really good for um, foundations, like if you want to add some moisture to a foundation, like use it as a cutting oil. That would be really nice. Then there is this BD, BDB, this brow kit. Scissors to trim your lashes, as well as tweezers. Yeah, it's pretty standard. So that's okay. And then is this the last product. Yes, I believe this is the last product. It's the Laura Geller Quench and Tint Hydrating Foundation and the shade light. Looks like this. Mm -hmm. Let me rip the sticker here. This is just supposed to give a nice sheer tint, so yeah, it blends in very, very well. Mm. 
It doesn't have a scent to it really. I'm just smelling the jasmine oil on my hands. Alright. And yeah, I think that was the last one. So to recap, it was this cleanser right here by Bite of Bread. This pixie skin treats, jasmine oil. Laura Geller foundation or a uh, tint moisturizer, I should say. Uh, this brow kit from Billion, Billion Dollar Brow. And finally, this lip balm scrub combo from Glow Recipe. Alright, and of course, these were. Complimentary. Alright, so I think that's it. Overall, I think this is a really good bag. I'll definitely use everything in it. So, yeah. Um, if you don't know already, it's the Glam Bag Plus is $25 a month, I believe. $24 a month. I don't really remember, but it's a. Uh, I've been getting it for around two years, two or three years now, and they consistently have a very good value. So if you're interested in trying out Ipsy for the first time, um, this is a very good place to start. They usually give full size items as well. Uh, it's usually five full size products. And if they do give deluxe size products, they're usually pretty big and they'll include like several of them. So, yeah. Uh, overall, I hope you enjoyed this. And if you found this review helpful or this unboxing helpful, go ahead and leave a like if you so please and subscribe. And I will talk to you again soon. Bye. Thank you.